Hello, my beautiful sweets. Sweet Sadie J coming back at you. Hope everyone's having a wonderful day, afternoon, evening, whatever time you're watching this video. Today I came on to share a different kind of Dollar Tree haul, y'all. This is fantastic. I was thrilled when I found all this Rona, Corona protective gear at the Dollar Tree a couple of days ago. I It was like they got a memo that we didn't. But my instincts have been telling me all along to get prepared, be prepared, and stay prepared. I was just like thrilled, you guys, of all the protective um, gear. I showed you guys a little sneak peek on my community page of all the phenomenal things that I found. But we're going to jump right into this. So it's, yeah, I know. So it's not too long. But it always is. But welcome back to all my lovely subscribers. Thank you all so much, so very much for all of your love and support. I wanted to share two more Christmas cards that came in the mail today. Well, one came in the mail. It's from one of my subscribers. I'm just blown away. The stickers are so cute. I don't want to show the envelope because, you know, of our addresses. But she sent me this card that says warm wishes. So cute with the gingerbread house. I was like, ooh, how pretty. I love color. Y'all know I just love colors. She wrote in it, Sadie, hope your Christmas is as jolly as a holiday can be. Love your channel. Thank you for what you do. With a smiley face. Sincerely, Jamie Leesman, subscriber. Isn't that darling? That was so sweet of her. So I have another Christmas card to add to my Christmas tree. Thank you so much, Jamie. I appreciate your kindness. I love that. I'm just like thrilled. And then my neighbor, my friend, my pain in the butt, my friend Walter, who lives right around the corner from me, he put this on my door. So darling. A beautiful, beautiful card. It says Merry Christmas. You all see that? Merry Christmas. Isn't that beautiful, y'all? I mean, look at that scenery. That is so nice. Inside he wrote, May your Christmas be blessed with peace and joy, Walter with love, and a happy new year. And this, he's got a scenery in here on this card that's just as um, pretty. Looks like that. But I have no idea what Walter was drawing me here, y'all. Does anybody know what this is supposed to be? <laughs> when I see him the next time, I'll have to ask him. But he drew something in there. And I have no idea what in the world that's supposed to be. But anywho, I digress. It is a true meaning of Christmas collection. And that's what it says on the back. True meaning of Christmas. Very, very nice. So those are my two Christmas cards that I've received today in the mail. And now we can jump into this Dollar Tree haul real quick. I, my mom needed some more gloves for her baking. She's making sweet potato pies and apple pies for Christmas. And I'm making a coconut cake. And that's my story. And I'm sticking to it. Anywho. <laughs> I haven't been feeling 100%. So, y'all excuse me. My asthma is getting better. It really is. But these are the nitrile, um, nitrile exam gloves because they don't make your hands itch. They don't break you out. They don't have that powder stuff in them. You know, so I got her two packs. I just got my sister a couple of packs and gave them to her. Then I picked up two more. Excuse my reaching. I picked up two more of my soft, super soft paper towels because I love these paper towels. If you're going to buy a paper towel from the Dollar Tree, I would implore you suggest to you that you buy these because they are so nice for a dollar and with the holidays right around the corner on us and i will be in the kitchen doing a little bit of cooking praise god my sisters decided that we would all make different dishes and get together at mom's this christmas so i'm excited about that okay what else did we get I was just going to cook a small dinner for myself, y'all, and take mom over a plate, but this is fine. I love when they come down and visit. I love when we get together. and We're just going to be safe like we did on Thanksgiving. But they restocked the Lysol wipes again, and I had an opportunity to get four more the last time, and I didn't do it. But like I said, all of a sudden, Dollar Tree just had an eruption of 
all this protective gear, Corona protective gear. So I took advantage of it. Unfortunately, they did limit you to only four at a, um, per customer. And I could have gone over to this um, smaller Dollar Tree, which I did, but I don't know what happened. I guess maybe I just didn't want to be greedy or something, but I could have gotten four more of all these things. But this is the lemon wipes that y'all saw me buy, the disinfectant wipes. And I just think this is so good to have these things on hand, you know, in your car, in your purse, at home, wherever you go, you know, clean, clean, clean. And then they had these haven't seen disinfectant spray in the Dollar Tree and I don't know when y'all but they had these home bright disinfectant sprays and I was like oh they're so cute look at them they're two ounces two ounce cans this one is the country scent kills flu viruses eliminates odor and this one is the lemon scent and I just thought they were darling and again I would have liked to have gotten another four of these but I just did not think about it, y'all. Um, when I was when I went from one store to the next, I just did not think about grabbing. Let me see if we can see this. Grabbing um, four more of these cans. So basically, I got one can for each of us, my mom, my two sisters, and myself. So I got those, and then I saw these new. Well, they're new to me. They're called Wailana. Wailana. White Lana three layer protective face mask. They look like this. Okay, you get two in a pack, two non medical masks. They're obviously from China because each one of them have these little um, receipts of some type in here. I'm assuming that's Chinese. I'm not fluent in Chinese or Japanese, but since most of our stuff comes from China, I'm going to just assume it's from China but you can see each one of them have that little tag in the back and they basically just say three layer protective face mask um, high efficiency filtration 90% easy to breathe um, soft and comfortable lightweight and disposable so I was like okay let's give these a whirl what's going on here straighten up let's give these a whirl sorry about that y'all I didn't even look up to see it was and stop focusing so yeah i got now i i don't know if these were limited to four because that was my intention to get four but i believe they were sticking to each other so i got i ended up with seven of them and i don't know how that happened but my girls at both my dollar trees know me so they might have just let it slid without me even knowing i don't know but I was like, look, <laughs> when I went back the next day to get some more of this stuff, y'all, there was none, none, absolutely nada. So I ended up with seven of these and there's two in each pack. So that's a great deal. Of course, I will be sharing them with my family as always. And then did I show y'all the box of Scott tissues? I just got one box of Scott tissues. It's nothing major. Then I saw these and I was just like, I think this is what made me go blank when I saw these because I've been seeing few, a few people here and there with these and I'm always asking where they get those from, where they get them. They have them at the Dollar Tree, y'all, for one dollar. One dollar. Okay? And they just call them a face shield. Carefully take out the face shield from protective plastic bag. Place the elastic strap around the head. Reusable face shield. And then it gives you the cleaning instructions. Dry with um, cleaning recommendations. Dry with a soft cloth to prevent scratches. Do not clean face shield with abrasive products or with chemical solvents. After cleaning and disinfecting it, it is recommended to store the face shield in a sealed plastic bag to prevent from scratching and, con and contamination. So, this is what it looks like. And I'm going to carefully, if I can, open this up. Let's see. I might have to perforate it with my nail. I should have had my scissors here, but y'all know I'm always unprepared. <sighs> so we're going to try to put this in as open it as carefully as possible because I want to put it back in here. And then we're going to pull it out. And it has the strap. 
with the foam piece for your head. And let's see. Let me take this off for a minute. And there it is. Whoop! There it is. Whoop! Now, do you still wear a face mask under this? Because I feel like the air, the solvents, the molecules will get right up in here. <laughs> what do y'all think? I would probably still wear my face mask under this. But for added extra protection, I think this is great. It does have an echo up in here. Hello? Hello? <laughs> But I was like, you guys, for a dollar, for one dollar, we found this at the, uh, they limited you only to four each, y'all, so that's the only reason why I didn't go ham, <clears throat> I didn't break the bank, because they limited you to only four um, per customer. Now, my sister works in a hospital, so she has privy to all the protective gear that you know she needs but my mom and my younger sister and myself we do not but I still bought her one if she wants one so I did get four of these and of course the one I opened will be mine so I got four four of these <laughs> so I thought that was score that was a great score for a dollar y'all know Dollar Tree shopping is all about the thrill of it being just a dollar. Now, I know a lot of stuff I've shown you. We could go to Walmart to get it for less money. If you want to walk that football field and stand on those long three lines that might be open, might be open, yeah. But for a couple of pennies more, you can get it at the Dollar Tree. You're in there. You're out of there. That's just my take on it. You don't have to agree with me. That's just how I feel about it. When you get a body full of all these ailments that I have, you'll know. <laughs> you'll understand why I'm so passionate about, you know, going to the Dollar Tree and it only being a dollar, you know. Because, I mean, I looked up my grocery shopping list and I could have gotten my mandarin oranges in the can for, in the light serve, for like 87, 89 cents at Walmart's. But once again... At what cost? <laughs> but anyway, I digress. <laughs> but the last item that I found, and I saw this floating around on YouTube, y'all, and I started hyperventilating. I'm like, my tongue wants to move faster than my brain or vice versa. I don't know. But anywho, I found these. These little scanners, as seen on TV, they say they're new, safe, and healthy disinfectant UV lights. Do y'all believe that? Do y'all believe something like this is, is all we need? I don't know. But I, hey, for a dollar, I'm willing to try it, okay? But it's just like they had them everywhere, y'all. They were packed out. And when I went back the very next day, there was none to be found anywhere in either stores. I was like, well, you know, maybe they'll make nice gifts. Maybe I should go back and get one for mom because I actually did not get one for her because she's usually with me when she goes out. And so I would scan, you know, everything in the car or whatever. But it's, I just thought it was great to have. It says kills 99.9% .9 of harmful viruses germs and bacteria and then they have pictures on the back where you can use it on your mask toys your computer <laughs> excuse me your cars your shipping boxes your doorknobs phones keyboard basically anything y'all but i had to get it it said it cleans without chemicals enhanced hygiene and great for travel powerful uv light lab tested technology Portable, folds down, works on any surface. So, yeah. I got three of them. One for my, myself and mom and one for each of my sisters. So, I don't know how they're going to work. I don't know if they do work. But, honey, I checked the price on um, Walmart. And I think I saw it at Walmart for 10 something. I'm not really sure. I was supposed to write it down. But, y'all know me. Y'all know how scatterbrained I am. So, yeah. I got three of these. 
and I was really thrilled to find him because some things I could do without and some things I just won't. I have to take a road trip, you know, <laughs> to go get these. But once again, the gods, the gods are just working in my favor. I did not need to take no road trip. Thank you, Lord. And the last of the items, that's it on the Dollar Tree haul, you guys. But that's what I was telling you about. All of a sudden, um, Dollar Tree just spit out or vomited out or got a memo or something and put all this stuff out all at one time. And I was happy they did. But while I was out running around, I ran up to Roses for something. And this is just a few things I got. I saw this Barton's Dark Coconut and Cream. And I told y'all I've been craving coconut and chocolate. And I love it in the dark chocolate like the Mounds bars. But I've never heard of the Barton. But it was only a dollar at Roses. So I was like, yeah, let me try it. And then I found this. And I had one of these before, you guys. But for the life of me, I cannot find it. And I saw it at Roses the other day for only $6.99. I was like... They said compare it at other places for $12.99, but this is how I'm going to put my pillows together real quick. I hope if it works, the little portable, so great, portable sewing machine. It includes three bobbins, two needles, needle threader, and spindle, and it takes four AA batteries. So, yeah, this is what I got, and I was thrilled. I really was, because I was... You know, Christmas is almost here, y'all, and I have not done our pillows yet, and I really wanted to do them this year, so I got that from Roses, and then I, they had these, excuse me, Candy Cane Story, Jesus, um, Jesus, sweetest name I know, they had these up at the front of Roses. They had the Candy Cane, and they had a lollipop, like a star lollipop. But the lollipop, each one that I got, they were cracked. They were broken. So I just got this. I never saw this before. It said scripture, candy, reaching the world one piece at a time. And you get these little bookmarks in there. And the front, I don't know if you guys are going to be able to see this. The front, it show the front and the back of the bookmark. Let's see if it will focus for me. And I just thought that was just so cute. And they were only a dollar. So I did get this one. Because like I said, I wanted the one with the star on it too. But the, all, the, all the stars were, um, they were broken. They were cracked. So I didn't get it. And it, all it says is, the candy cane story. Jesus, sweetest name I know. And I can't wait to open it. But I just wanted to show you guys what I found at Roses. Y'all know I love me some roses. And that wasn't even on Senior Citizen Day, y'all. Y'all know I don't go to Roses if it ain't Senior. <laughs> but I did this time because I went in there. Excuse me. I went in there for something specific. And I, of course, you know, I forgot what it was. Because as soon as you walk in those stores, you get distracted. So, but that is the end of my... Dollar Tree haul and little throw in from roses. I hope you guys enjoy watching. Love, peace, and happiness. Sweet Sadie J coming back at you. Remember, guys, be kind to each other. The world is big enough for us all. Merry Christmas and happy holidays to everyone. I love you all so very much. Please like, comment, and subscribe. And have a blessed day. Bye.